It looks like the field between Senator Onure Mitsimiku of Lagos State and Senator Dino Melaye of Police State is taking another dimension. Just about a few hours ago, a set of women declared that they are coming to the National Assembly to protest against what they call impunity against the human race. And as you can see behind me, is the National Assembly complex and the set of women that have come even to make their stand known. They have talked about the reason behind their convergence. Let us hear them. We are all aware as Nigerians about what happened at the National Assembly uh, between Senator Dino Melai and uh, Senator Tino. So we feel that this, this is a, we, are, we are here today to affirm ourselves, to affirm our rights as Nigerian women, that we will not tolerate any one more impunity, that enough is enough. Yes. We cannot continue to abuse the rights of women, rape women, beat women, and nothing will happen. We see this as uh, something that we feel that the Nigerian government should take very seriously. They are part of the community. If either you are a politician or not, you are still a member, part of this community. And a situation where we have been pleading that we want more women to come into politics, to change the face of governance. Now they are being threatened. Even those of you who are here, your husbands, with all that is happening, will you still allow your wife to come into politics? That is the issue. All this impunity must stop. There should be no gender. You know, in the Senate chambers, is a hollow chamber. There should be no gender, woman or man. Everybody must be given their due respect. Speaking further, they talk about the stand of the Nigerian police against women. To them, Nigerian police is not protecting the women as they should be. Citing example of the murdered female preacher in Kubwa, Abuja. The woman that died, who was a preacher? wouldn't have died if we have a system that is effective. Absolutely. Because while she was there, she was screaming. That would not happen in other countries. Yes. And since that day, have we really had anything from the police in terms of investigation? Have we really had anything? And I think that the question we should ask ourselves is that why are all this happening with Indians? So if it's happening in the national assembly, it will happen everywhere. It will happen on the street, it will happen in our different homes, and that's why we are here to say enough is enough. This women and also chanting numerous kind of songs to abuse and to fight for their rights. Impunity don't end that for trouble. The protest took another dimension when the protesters demanded to gain access into the National Assembly. But the men of the Nigerian police denied them access by barricading the area. They however made the demand to see the Senate President, Bukola Saraki. maintain that the Senate must look into this situation. We are expecting the Senate to make a law that will help the rights of the women in totality. After the demonstration, it is now left. Maybe the Senate look into the crowd and find solution to it. Or the Senate just sit and not say anything about it. Let's see what this woman plan to do next and let's see what according to them the right of the women in Nigeria is. From the National Assembly Congress, Abayomi Akegola, PTV News, Abuja.